Hi there, nail besties. Welcome back to the channel. Let me sit back a little because I'm so close to you right now. Um, so, uh, I got kind of lost there. My, I'm going to do my nails today. Uh, they really, really, really need it. They look like shit. As you can see, the staining is fully complete. It really is only stain resistant, the top coat. So far, this is the first test. I'm not doing a full review right now. We're going to try it a couple more times. The windows are open. There's a breeze. That's what you're experiencing. Enjoy. But the Wonder Gel, um, it stayed stain resistant for about five days. And then it, you started seeing buildup. And it was not coming off. So it's time to change these nails. I also have a broken nail. I have a cracked nail. And... Frankly, I just want a fresh set. And if you saw yesterday's video, because actually I put that video up today. I made it yesterday, but I'm going to, this is a video for tomorrow. So if you saw yesterday's video, you saw what Dolly's wearing. And I actually think I'm going to do something a little similar because first of all, I want to practice doing these unicorn nails. I really want to practice more on my marbling. And I think we're going to do sort of a fall-themed unicorn set. I'm going to go ahead and remove these nails. Um, I'll share as much of that with you as I can. Uh, that's kind of hard. Then we will prep and do the nails. Um, and if the video is too long, then we'll split it into two. We'll craft the nails in one and decorate them in another okay so stay tuned stay right here for all the hullabaloo we'll be right back
Okay guys, I went on ahead and did the other hand off camera because it's just, it's hard enough to do, you know, it's hard enough to do my dominant or non-dominant hand than to work with my non-dominant hand on camera. I can barely stay in frame this way, right? I know you know that's true. So I'm just going to clean these off with alcohol and uh, we're going to go ahead and, and do some nails. Oh, I do want to say, okay, so sorry for the shaky cam. <sighs> I can't seem to settle today. Um, so clearly I've not been as diligent with my nail care as I should be because I am having some eczema issues on this finger. And that's my own fault because if I'm taking really good care of my skin, that does not happen. And so, bad GG, bad. We will do better. I will, it is, it is one of my goals to constantly be improving the way I treat myself. So this was a backslide and I feel bad about it. So this is gonna sting on that nail is maybe what I'm saying to you. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just get these two nails ready to go. And because, I don't think so much on this one, maybe here at the tip, because a lot of them, sorry, I'm, I'm out of frame, because in some spots on all of them, there may be a little spot where natural nail was completely uncovered, so I'm just going to clean everything. And do you see Jake? Jake hair. Jake hair. Puppity duppity hair. Okay. And I'm going to go in with some primer. I'm also going to tell my hand to kindly stop shaking. And like I said, just in case there's any parts that are completely exposed, we're just going to coat the whole nail. Really, I don't see how that could hurt. And the um, prep and primer that we are using today are Mia Secret. So you know. I'm just going to give that a quick shakety shake, shake, shake. And we're going to go in for a second coat. And I'm going to stop shaking. Now. That helps. I'm just trying to not touch my nails down on the paper. <laughs> Cause that defeats the purpose of primer. Okay guys, I sat here for a second and just sort of in my mind mapped out what I wanna do. And one of the things that I want to do, which I'm not really super great at yet, is doing an extreme smile line. So, and I've not actually done one since my memorial set for my dog, which I haven't really talked about on the channel, but I lost a dog in January and I did a set of nails to honor him. You'd have to check the other channel for that. But um, I've decided I'm going to do on this finger another nail similar to this but I'm going to try to tweak it a little but I'm going to do it in a stiletto. The rest of the nails are going to be coffin but I want to do an extreme smile line here and one here too. So I thought it, we would just do the extreme smile line together um, in real time. 
So I'm just going to say this may end up being kind of a long video. And I hope that you don't hate that. So I'm going to use soft pink for that. And let me get some alcohol here. And I've got a little pad to clean my brush on. Let me just go ahead and thicken that a little. And I've got my handy dandy scooper de doopity scooper. So I'm just going to take a little dollop and plop it right on here. And I suppose um, this method is called the reverse application method. So forgive me if I'm wrong about that, but I think that's correct. Let me know in the comment section below. Below. I'm just going to work this up a little bit. I feel like maybe I got a tiny bit too much. Do, do, do. Oops, 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 oops. Okay, let me try to scoop in on this a little. There we go. Hope that's not too shaky, Cam. I'm so sorry about that. One of these days, this channel is going to grow a little bit and I'll be able to spend some money on um, some equipment, <laughs> right? Yeah, I definitely feel like that is too much product. So let's let's just scoop a tiny bit away, just the tiniest bit. I do want to bring it down a bit, but that seems like it was going to be a lot bit. And we will definitely be filing, you know, to make sure everything is right. Oh, a little sticky, a little sticky. And we are today, uh, at least for this particular thing, because I like the soft pink color, is this is Joya Mia um, Acryl Gel in soft pink. Wow, I love poly gel. It is so fun. Oh, guys, I'm so sorry. I'm not even on camera. Oh, my goodness. We're in frame. Can't do it right, can't say it right. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna pop that in the old lamparoon. All right, tappy tap, tap, tap. Okay, I actually really, really like that shape, but just to make sure, I wanna get this out of the way, that this is nice and refined, I'm just gonna give it the tiniest bit of a file. And of course, I'm not letting you see it. Why would that happen? It's only a nail video. <laughs> Forgive your girl. Forgive your girl. Oops. I want to take a little on that top action there too because it just seems a little bit like what I'm seeing there. It's kind of just like making a really, really, really short, oddly shaped um, oval nail, right? <laughs> I absolutely love that. Okay, what I want to do is grab a paper towel and rip a little piece from it. And I do just want to wipe this off a tiny bit to make sure I don't have any dust there. 
I'm just being super gentle. I'm not trying to get it on my sticker. On my sticker. Okay, so I'm going to stick with the poly gel for just a moment. Um, not the pink, just the clear. Just to make that little shelf at the bottom, you know what I mean? So that we can put some glitter and whatnot in there. You know what I mean. I'm just going to take a little bit because we can add more if we need it. And we really do want this to be super thin. We just want to make sure it's connected, connected, connected. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys. I'm out of frame. I really suck at making these videos, but one day I'll be a lot better. And then you guys will be like, girl, you did it. I saw the whole thing. <laughs> Either that or I'll get so good at editing, you'll be like, she meant to do that. Look at how good she is. No, that's that's never what you're going to say. Sorry, I get it. Okay, I also need something to sit on, so I'm not shaking for you. y'all I'm feeling so stressed I'm just gonna grab a little more we're gonna slab it right there so I can push it up into place I'm just trying to make that coffin shape this a little more under here. <sighs> Guys, you didn't see that, but off camera is where my alcohol and everything is sitting. And um, I just went to dip my brush in the alcohol, but I dipped it in my poly gel <laughs> like somehow that was going to wet my brush because <laughs> it was sitting right next to it right okay, I just want to make sure this is nice and flat so we can really fill it up with some glitter and stuff you want some glitter and stuff let's have some glitter and stuff um I just feel like this end bit needs a little more I'm going to pull out some because that's, I think, partially why you're not seeing me. Sorry for shaky cam. really struggling guys but I think maybe we got it it was also maybe not smart to do this as the first nail of the day when I could have just sculpted a regular nail so there is that there's that okay I'm gonna pop her in the lamp Okay, guys, we're going to try something we hope works. How about that? How about that? 
So what I'm going to do now is switch over to some actual gel, just some clear gel. And I am going to just paint the nail with it. Just, just this bottom part here. Just so we've got a spot for our glitter to press into. Alrighty. <clears throat> so before we do the, oh, actually, no, let's just do the glitter press real quick. We're going to use this really pretty bronzy glitter that I like quite a bit. Oh, there it is. Sorry, I couldn't find my little brush. And I'm just going to press it right into that wet gel. Oh, I like that a lot. That's so pretty. But I don't think that's quite enough. I think we need... A little something around this edge up here. I'm gonna just wipe that down. I'm gonna go ahead and just give that a quicky, quick, quick, quick flashy flash. Just a little flashy flash. Okay, and then I'm gonna take the striping brush and first. Let me just make sure it's nice and soft. First, I'm gonna take, I took some uh, top coat and mixed it with some of this red pigment. And I just want to pick some of that up and run it along in here. Just to give us a little bit of something else here. And this is going to be uh, pulled together by some other, other elements that will be in the art that we do. And then, just to be a little fancy and different, we are not going to use the red all the way around. Oops, I got some of the red <laughs> on my file. We are going to take some black and run it along on the other side. And meet those together in the middle. Just for funsies. All right, I'm going to pop this in the lamp and let it cure for a full minute. Okay, now we're just going to take some more of that uh, builder gel and encapsulate all this glitter and stuff. Actually, just glitter and color. Okay. <laughs> just glitter and color. Just going to take it all the way up the sides. Don't want to push, you just want to glide it and say, hey, you, you want to go over here? Yeah, you do. How about that? Look how pretty you are there. And it goes, you know what? I am pretty there, god darn it. Dang, nabbit, you're not wrong. I'm like, you are not wrong. You're not wrong, Gel. Look at how pretty you are actually really like gel you guys <laughs> and I'm just in a nonsensical mood today 
I've been having some anxiety attacks and whatnot and honestly just being a YouTuber can be stressful so even though I don't have a big channel you know just just the ideas of things can be stressful you know you know but I just keep reminding myself the only person who's really judging me that matters is myself and um, if the construct if the criticism isn't constructive it's not worth listening to so this is a little lumpy bumpy but absolutely fileable into the shape that I'm looking for so what we're going to do is go ahead and cure this when we come back I'm going to be speeding up to get through the rest of these nails and we will meet back at the end of that
right, besties, we have the nails on. I have them all filed and they are ready to decorate. And that will be in the next video because <clears throat> this video was a long time in the making. I am tired um, and I really just want to relax and go to bed before I think of these nails again. So what I'm going to do is just add a little oil to these because my cuticles are destroyed right now. And the oil that I'm using right this second, because it was handy, is just some rosehip oil. Now, I did want to just give you a little idea of what we're going to do. If you recall yesterday's video where we did these on Dolly, we are going to do something very similar on the nails that don't have glitter on them <clears throat> on me. So be sure to come by and check that out. I do want to thank everyone who comes by regularly and watches these videos. And for the people who are leaving awesome comments, I'm really grateful to have you showing up and to let me know what you think about the videos. It really just... It makes me so, so, so excited. Um, so thanks. Thanks, guys. You're really, really awesome. And I just couldn't be more pleased to have you here watching videos and let me know what you think about them. So keep doing that, and I'll keep doing this, and let's grow the channel. Let's have a wonderful time together doing nails, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye, guys.